So, good question. Um, so I have a few reasons. The first one is if I'm doing what I'm doing now, which is SimCom, means I'm speaking English and signing at the same time. That means I'm speaking in two languages at the same time. Although one language is verbal and auditory, you can hear it, verbal, that's English, obviously, and sign is a visual language, you're still using both at the same time. And so already as I'm speaking, I've already felt myself making signed errors and it doesn't feel natural for me. Can you fully understand me? It's so hard to speak English and sign at the same time. Some people can do it, like I'm doing now, but some people do it and choose to like I'm doing now, but for me, I feel like if I do that, the deaf audience is like, what is she saying? Because my signs are not accurate. Um, so I just feel like, and also our blogs, our vlogs, everything. See, that was a mistake. I said movie or video, but it's a vlog. So that's one little little mistake. But our vlogs are about our sign world, our marriage, our life, our experiences. And in our home, I don't use my voice at all. If I'm on the phone, it's different, but it's true. When I'm mad at him, for some reason, I sim calm. I don't know. I don't know. He's like, why are you voicing? I'm like, how do you know? How do you know that I'm voicing when I'm mad at you? How can you tell? Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, but what was I saying? Oh, right. So our vlogs are about our world and our life. So I feel like if I simcom, I'm changing our life for the audience, but that's not the point. The point is we're showing our life. So I'm going to decide to have my voice off, sign, and you can read the closed captions. Um, I don't know. Um, maybe if I'm filming myself alone and he's not watching, sure. Um, but I probably won't simcom because it's still the same reason there's going to be a lot of errors in my signing. Or I can sign and speak in a way that's not normal. So I just prefer to use one or the other. Um, so that's why. 